And so when we do benchmarking, there's six distinct phases we go through. The prepare stage is talking to subject matter experts, and then we start to profile high performance. After we do the preparation, we then go into the define stage. And this is where we build those key accountabilities that you and I reflected on last week. We start to create a benchmark of what superior performance looks like. Once we move out of the define stage, we move into the screening phase. And that's when we get talent. Both of you gentlemen have done this. We get you to complete a higher sense report. And then we start to do analysis of that report and recommendations. Does this person fit the job? Do they have the right characteristics to do the job? Now, based on that, the company then selects their talent and starts to do the interviews and then brings them into the business and make sure they're a culture fit. Is You and I are going back to this onboarding phase. So you've already been at the business, you're already working in the business, but we're going back to this onboarding phase. And the reason why we're doing that is that I want you to have a very high level of clarity of what your job requires from you. So there's no role confusion. Okay, this is what it takes to be a superior performer and this is what it looks like. So we're doing that. Once we do the onboarding, we then get into the development phase. So you and I are working both in the onboarding and development phase. What we're doing today is we're going to the phase here on onboarding where it says talent and leadership fit. 